Hi, my name is Andreas Bauernfeind and I'm a mechanical engineer. Since more than three years, I'm member of the TU Wien space team. Currently, I'm the vice president and the head of mechanics of our project, The Hound. As head of mechanics, I'm responsible for the design, the manufacturing and the assembling of our rocket. Today, I want to talk about two topics. The first topic is about the components of our rocket. And the second topic is about the test flights that we have already performed. As we've already mentioned before, we have a two-stage design. Each stage has the same design principle. The biggest and largest part of our rocket are the motor casings. The motor casings are also part of the airframe. The outside diameter is equal to the biggest diameter of our rocket. On the bottom of our rocket, we mount the fin can and the tail cone and on top of the motor casing, there is the electronic bay. The drog and the parachute are inside the nose cone. The most important parts of our rocket are the aluminum 3D printed fin cans and the airframe of the upper stage, which is made of high temperature glass fiber reinforced polymers both are necessary to withstand the high temperatures at hypersonic speeds. The second topic I want to talk about, test flights. Up to date we performed five test flights, one single stage and four two-stage flights. During our test flights two major issues occurred. The ignition of the upper stage turned out to be more difficult than we have expected, but this is crucial for the high altitude flight. The other problem was a malfunction of the booster. During the stage separation, the parachutes deployed and the booster landed hard. The electronics have been a little bit toasty, but with minor changes we could fix this problem. Besides these test flights, we have also tested our new electronic revisions on other rockets. In total, we performed more than 15 test flights in the last two years. Most of the videos are available on our YouTube channel. If you have any questions, let us know and comment below.